So it's kind of nice when things play out exactly how you thought they would. And when it comes to ICP, we knew that price was going to do this. We talked about it several weeks ago, and we've finally been building into this trend. Now, what I'm talking about is we obviously went down, we tested the $9.50 range, we had a hard bounce out of there. And since then, we started our recovery where we've been working within this channel, testing the top, testing the bottom, testing the top, testing the bottom. And so naturally, at some point here, ICP was going to make another test at the top. This is a kind of explosive move like we talked about here in the charts. And lo and behold, look at what we're doing today. Now, we've obviously retraced in some of this candle, but you can see this massive explosive move to the upside finally taking place in terms of ICP. So this is, this is a great sign. Now, what this means is at some point this week, if we continue to show strength in terms of ICP, if BTC continues to rally and institutional money continues to flow in and we, we try to test like that 54 to 56 K level would not be surprised if we come back to try to test our cycle high, which is very exciting because if we can break that, if we can break out of this channel, then we're kind of up in no man's land. We're kind of up in that $20 range. Like we were talking about and as always, again, this is not financial advice. There's no guarantees, but there has been some very good things happening over this past week here. We know that Coinbase International is adding perpetual futures for internet computer, among a few other things. We know that uh, that CKBTC assets are jumping as well. So we're, we're getting help from even outside of ICP, which is nice because it's kind of nice to not be alone here because the more assets that are running at the same time, the more sustainable these pumps become. Now, again, I wouldn't be surprised if we do take this stab to the upside. It'd be kind of nice to nestle in at a higher level here. Okay. We've talked about these steps that take place. So here was our step. This is a big elongated step here, basically floating around, you know, 13 bucks. You can see how long we've, it, it almost seems like we've been here forever. All right. Because we had our rally back in late December. And basically since then we haven't done much. So we've had almost two months of, of essentially sideways trading. Now we have been building up, but it's basically just been a recovery back to the level that we're at. And now that the market is showing this extreme strength, we can take our stab at our next step. ICP is in price discovery, all right? It's trying to figure out what its value is right now. The market is trying to figure out what its value is right now. And that's where things truly get exciting because I've talked about my projections for this cycle high. I think we can get somewhere into that, you know, $250 range. As always, this is not financial advice. And it's possible we could even go further beyond that with, with bigger, excuse me, with bigger adoption, more building, things like that but we just have to wait and see how things play out. It's all a process. And right now we're working through our process. We're looking very good. Adoption rates are high. And I will say that although we don't necessarily have the same kind of FOMO that we had back here, you can see that we were heavily in the overbought range by the time we got to this price. This is a nice, slow, steady range of accumulation. So this is a sustainable pump right now. So I appreciate you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know your thoughts below. Have a great day. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Take care.